Even Kizito at this point in his life, at the hospital, the mom is still pushing him to do what? Guys, this woman is something else. Thank you so much for the like, for the share, for everything you do. I don't take it for granted. Thank you so much. So today's episode, we remember the last episode that um, the Kizito mom and F. Flora and everyone, all of them, we are at the hospital and they were discussing what to do. Then at this episode, the doctor called George and Flora to inform them that Angel is getting worse and worse. That at this point, she don't know what to do, but she invited a doctor's friend. She seek the opinion of a doctor friend who told them that um, it's either they try they try something to see if it will work you understand to see if it will work and it's 50 50 reanating is 50 50 is either it gets worse or it gets better you understand and guys it's just and this particular reality pro, uh, process we actually make like Omar to experience what she experienced before at this point George said we were not there so how do we know that this is what she experienced and this is not what she experienced the doctor said we all know that is ROAPE so definitely we know what it is so we know how to go about it but Flora said ah if that is the case if that can help her let's try it because Omar yes I don't know Omar but from what I have heard about Oma, the only thing I can wish is for her to get better. That lady needs to get better because she has stood for everybody. That at this point in her life, she needs them to stand up for her. So guys, they went out and they said they would discuss with the family. Both of them are just friends to the family. So now they want to discuss with the family. The doctor don't know how they will, the family will take it. That is why she called Kizito and flora fell so when uh, george approached angel angel said if that is the only thing that can be done to save her sisters to help her sister situation that she don't mind that she don't want seeing oma at that state anymore guys so flora on her own was you know was receiving call and kizito mom imagine kizito mom <laughs> guys this woman have, has a lot of gods. So, Kizito, um, George and Oma embraced themselves that all oh, because George actually promised, sorry, George and Angel embraced themselves because George actually promised Angel that after all these storms that are pulling, if everything gets back to normal, that he will make sure she never cry again, she never pass through what she's passing through again. And Angel said, don't forget, I still have a child inside my tummy. I still have Kizito child inside my tummy. And George said, when we get to that bridge, we are going to cross it. So George still feels the same thing he feels for Angel. Nothing has changed. Yeah, nothing has changed at all because if Angel, she, he's still promising Angel that even if she leaves that marriage today, that he is still there for her. And for me, what are friends for when he does only say it, but show it in action? Yeah. So, Kizito mom went to Kizito's room. Kizito's room at the hospital where Kizito is giving a bed with his broken head. So, Kizito mom was there telling Kizito, this is not time for you to give up. That you need to stand up and fight. Hey God, you need to find them. You don't slide down there and keep quiet as if nothing is happening. That you need to do something. You really need not to let them to go on free. You need to do something. And Kizito was like, mom, are you not seeing that I'm doing something, that um, I'm still on this bed, that I cannot do anything on this bed, that I will arrange people to RIP George, that the plan is still ongoing, stop pushing, you know, so the mom was like, oh, Kizito, I know you very, very well, I know how you think, and Kizito was like, mommy, I, um, I'm not a mommy's boy. Allow me to get out from here first. Then you see that I have so many actions in place. And the mother said, you know, I'm your backbone. That when it comes to tats, when it comes to sense, 
you don't have it that i am the one that has everything that supplies you that if i live your your life a second that you are going to go down guys <laughs> that you are going to go down that all your sins will be brought to you all of them will come to you that i am the only one supply you the sense that you don't have sense at all to reason every anything and Kisito was like mom you should you can live my life i don't care live my life go i can handle myself even if uh, i will go down that even if i want to go down that i will go down with everybody who have who has hurt me i will go down with everybody who i have like he will not go down alone and the mom was like why are you so foolish why are you so like eh? you don't you 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 don't you don't have sense at all why are you like that why are you like that you don't have sense at all you can't think straight you can't think anyone you are still in this state even when the mother was saying everything it was like Mom, are you not seeing that my head hawks? You came in here. Did I call you here to come? Did I ask them to call you here to come and watch my situation or to help me out? My head hurts. Leave me. Let me just get healed first before carrying all those things that you want me to carry out. Guys. And the mother to, the mother was like telling him, you are so, 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 like you don't have sense at all. You are, your thoughts is very, very far from you. You are so sure of yourself. You are so sure of what you can do. I don't know that others can do something. Ah, Kizito. You know? So, the mom finally left left Kizito at um, the hospital. On her way going, Flora was on call. On her, on her call. Je, 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 doing her thing. And Kizito mom have the audacity. Hey! To collect her phone from her ear and gave her a very resenting slap on her cheek. And Flora did not hesitate to give her double of it. Guys, she doubled it for her. And Kizito Mom was very shocked because she wasn't expecting the return match. <laughs> she wasn't expecting the return match. And Flora told her, she said, Flora, you dare raise your hand on me? You dare raise your hand on me? I thought I have dealt with you. You blah, 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 blah. And Flora told her that next time you try it again, I will not only use my hand on you, I will use everything, both the one you know and the one you don't know, on you. <laughs> God, when an elder refused to behave like an elder, that is what befalls the elder. Yes. In my language, in my in some proverb, they will say when a snake does act like a snake, children will use snake and tie firewood. That is what is happening to Kizito mom. So guys, Flora warned her, that told her, pop and plain, I am angel are formidable forces now. I am angel and angel is me. Both of us to make sure that justice is saved in the life of you and your son. <laughs> God. And she was like, Flora, I, 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 I get rid of you seven years ago and I'm going to do it again. And Flora said, bring it on. That is why I am ready for you. I can't wait. Bring it on. That is why I went and I came prepared for you. Guys, hey, <laughs> God. Kizito mom never knew that the chicks she is she, she's seen, like she thinks she's seen, have grown into a hen. She don't know at all. She don't know. So guys, um, a jo um Jeff went to Kizito's room and he sat. And Kizito was like, Kizito looks like he kind of been terrified when he saw Jeff. What are you doing in my room? He jumped up on the bed. What are you doing here? Why did you come here? And uh, what is it called? Jeff told him, hmm, I came to see your ugly face. 
In fact, when Jeff sat down, Jeff was like looking at him. Look at the ugly nonentity that actually caused this to my sister's life. Is you that I targeted. So when Christo flip up, I was like, Jeff, I only came so that you tell me what happened to my friend. And Jeff was like, had it me, you told me politely. You asked me politely. I could have told you. Yes, it is I. And I'm very, very proud of it. That I wanted to teach you a lesson. I felt bad when the lesson was taught to your friend. But on a second hand, I don't feel bad anymore because that your friend still give you advice that are not good. So I don't feel any bad about it. And Kisito was like, so you did this to my friend? You wanted to do this to me? You will not go scot-free. I will deal with it. I will. You know how he used to shout at And Jeff told him, I can't wait for you at the outside world. Come, let's do it. But for me, I don't think it's okay for Jeff to to say to his face depend like when you want to attack somebody attack an enemy you don't need them to know your titles you get what i'm saying i don't know my my own opinion though so jeff was like bring it on i'm waiting for you at the outside world i did it and i'm very proud of it and now i can deal with you whatever i wish and don't forget is so more blame kisito for going to flora's house at all that maybe that is a, a a trap and you fell into it because of your stupidness <laughs> God. so kizito now told jeff that if he ever gets out from that bed that he is going to come for jeff and jeff on his own this time is not relenting at all like anything kizito and the mom wants is given to them i just pray that the people Kizito sent after George because according to him, he has already sent them already. I just pray that the people that were sent after George don't get to him. I pray that it becomes back to sender. And I hope that Omar regains conscious and become okay. Because guys, we need Omar to be alive. We need Kizito to actually test what he has been dishing for others to eat in life do what you know is right yeah because look at kizito mom look at kizito mom look at how she have placed her own life thank you so much and i thank god for flora for that resending back to send that to kiss at the chips at the cheek for me i love it i don't know about you Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to share, like, and follow. Subscribe. Anyone, anywhere you're watching from. Thanks. I love you. Bye-bye.